I'm dripping junket. Hey all doing everyone, Ralph here, Ralph is Reviews, Team Knucklehead, go clone, go home. Um, I've just reviewed this mod, the Conserve, and now we're going to look at the RDA that I'm using on top. It's the Goon LP, 528 LP, custom vapes. Um, again, it's one of them I wasn't sure and I'm glad I did, because I remember that, I'm sure it was called the Derringer. It was a little short arse, made for flavour. Uh, RDA. Now, they were good actually, they were alright, but they sort of died to death. Um, as people started building lower and demanding more from devices, I think they kind of got left behind. They used to get fucking blisteringly hot. So what, uh, that they made an old plastic cap um, to try and save you from burning your lips off and sticking your lips to it. Like These actually come with a, a, a plastic top half, if you like, little domey top bit for the same reason although I've not had any issues with it getting too warm with the build I've got in it which we'll look at in uh, in detail shortly let me have a vape if you're watching all of today's uploads you'll know that I've been raving about this vulture punch by button junkies that we've just got in so I'm slipping it in again it's fucking stellar we do crack panda as well which is a fruity cocktaily not really my thing this is custardy and creamy and strawberry and it's just everything that I like um, our own OG is my favorite all time it really really is uh, if you're a member of the group or follow the page on Facebook or follow me on Facebook you'll notice that we're stopping doing all of our pre-mixed flavors uh, juices liquid shock horror the, the TPD is a pain in the fucking arse and not something that I agree with in principle um, I won't get too into it but it's not designed to, to save lives and help people it's designed for big pharmaceutical and uh, tobacco companies to keep their niche on the market and keep their billions of pounds profit up these are the people that lied to us for all those years and are responsible for up to one billion deaths like since tobacco products became uh, ingrained as a, as an addiction but I digress um, we're going on to flavor shots we're going to start making concentrate well we do make it but we're going to start selling concentrate kits with our popular flavors in that you can DIY uh, I recommend everyone everyone either stick with your TPD compliant juices which this is yeah I know it's in 30 mil but uh, early next year the stocks of 30 mil will be gone and they'll be in 10 mil um, or start DIY mixing I'll do a video on them when we get the, the final packaging all together I'll do a video on them and I'll show you how to mix um, and what I do and hopefully it'll help a few people save a few quid and still enjoy juices that they like yeah lovely so let's get back to the Goon LP lovely little fucking device it really does it not only does it make a lot of flavor but it makes a lot of cloud um let's go into close up and we'll see what's what because me uh record things flashing saying that i'm coming something that's happening so i'll cut this short i won't waffle too much it says waffling on and we're going to close up and look at these goon lps see you in a minute So the Goon LP 528 Custom Vape Style RDA. Oh, comes with a bag of spares, spare screws, coils which I wouldn't use. They're not my bag, in a bag. A uh, little shitty screwdriver that we've all got hundreds of. Something to throw at the cat or something. And some spare O-rings for the body of it. You also get this black chuff cap, which I really like. Not only is it wider than the one provided, but it's going to keep everything a little bit cooler not that they overeat but it's a real nice touch and obviously you get the main event um, this one's black so you've got a black deck with a serial number take it with a pinch of salt yeah you've got gold plated 510 it's very hybrid friendly you see it sticking out and you've got this insulated drip tip so 
very very similar actually to the drip tip on the Mad Dog. Right. I wonder if they need to change. Let's have a quick pop. I bet they don't. Oh, they do. There you go. So that will be fit all of your custom tips for your Kennedys, for your goons, for all of that. 12.6 mil, I think they are, or half inch to his old boys. Inside, we've got two parts. Ooh, two parts to the top cap because we can fit this plastic one. But we've got this strange looking deck that I'm struggling to part show there you go hello so it's the usual goon clamp but it's flipped on its side yeah what a great idea each coil now is held by each side set of clamps you've got four clamps instead of two so you can work on one coil or two coils It's innovative, that is, innovative. Um, I've got a few Claptons in mine. And it literally is just a case of standing them in like that, tightening it up and then pulling it over so that it sits. You've just got to guesstimate how far up you want it to how far around it will come. And you're going to get there within one or two builds. I did this first attempt, second attempt. First attempt to cut the legs too short. Oh. Second attempt. But it works lovely. I mean, look at that. This is running 0 0.08. And it works a treat. It doesn't get too hot. It really makes loads of flavour. Um, I've got my coils just set above the top of the, the post there. So the airflow comes in underneath the coils to enhance that flavour. And these don't touch the top cap doesn't get too hot it really really works well you know we're all gold plated there on the terminals and we've got these teeny weeny little crosshead screws so just take a little bit of care of them when you're building it up and you'll be on to a winner it's really really cool yeah beautiful oh fumbled it beautiful bit of kit I'm seriously You've got the two part top. If there's a bump in the video, you're going to have to excuse me. For some reason, my phone's only recording three and a half minutes at a time. I don't understand what that's all about. It's got loads of room on it. Two part top, just a bit of airflow. Yeah. Um, there's no single coil option on the airflow. So, tough to lulus. But you can run single coil with two airflows. You know, block it off a wick if you're that anal about it, or just close it off a little bit. It's all down to overall draw, not that directional, especially in a unit this small. And you've got that lovely cool running 510 in half inch. So all your custom tips are going to fit. All in all, it's absolutely bob on. And don't they look good? Don't they look good? They do, don't they? Yeah, I told you they did. Let's go back up top. Because I want another vape, and I'll see you in a minute. Yeah, so uh, I don't know what's going on with the old camera today. Three minutes, three and a half minutes, I think it starts flashing and then maximum recording time reached and then it shuts off. Never had that before. I'll have a look when I finish doing this shit. Um, great bit of kit, the LP. I really, really rate it. They're, they're really, really fucking popular, honestly. They're flying, flying now. So we've got brass, we've got the black that I've just shown you in the close up. And we've got the stainless steel, which I, I really like. Um, okay, stainless steel job here. That's nearly. If I hadn't paired it up with this, it came in on the same day. If I've not paired up the brass, I'd have gone for the stainless. I really like the, the clinical, clean look of it. Get your little pouch. Uh, everything today seems to come in these uh, velveteen bags. You know, we've got the authentic apocalypse, which... Uh, um, about as fucking high end as you're gonna get. A, a huge fan of them. I love them to bits. And they come in a bag. You know, you think it's a bit cheap, but no, it's cool. It's the way things are. And that is the future. The future is bags. Forget your uh, garlic bread. It's garlic and bread. The future is bags. I've seen it. It's bags. <coughs> Sorry about that. So, yeah, it's great. It gives you a nice cool vape, even at 0 0.08 with our fuse claptons in. 
uh, it'll take a, a myriad of custom tips you've got the two cap options as well so you can run the, the slightly wider bore chuff cap in the Delrin or plastic or fucking formaldehyde or whatever it's made out of um, just to keep things even cooler it's good isn't it? I was worried that the airflow would be a bit too tight because it's so much smaller than the standard goon because you've got that little slot it looks a bit like a, a robot one eye robot um, instead of the three holes that you can adjust it's fine it really is fine um, as you know I've not got the, the greatest lungs in the world but I can certainly blast this bastard it's good it certainly is one for the flavour junkies yeah and cloud chasers alike because it certainly performs so check them out i'll put a link in as always thanks for watching it's been a blast enjoy the rest of your time and uh, remember people smoking kills vaping saves lives which do you choose big love everyone i'll see you all again soon